Good morning everybody. Hope everybody is having a great day today. Today I would like to make a quick video on how to uh, replace one of these WiseNet Hard One cameras. Uh, today we have one of the uh, PNM 9022V network camera. This is a 180 degree view and um, just had extra time to make a video so let's get to it. So the customer already showed me where the location of this camera is going to be at. Let's go take a look. Well, it's going to be right there. There used to be a camera right there, so I'm going to be replacing it. Uh, one of my old projects here. Uh, so cable's was already there. I seriously doubt that they they took the camera down, but I seriously let that seriously doubt that they ended up covering the connection there it's a network camera so probably we're gonna find some corrosion or maybe even have to terminate re-terminate the end of the RJ45 but yep we're gonna need a tall ladder here and uh, we'll go from there all right guys I was just waiting for the customer to send me the IP information since this is a network camera apologize for the background noise it's a truck swinging by but I got my computer ready, POE injector, and my cord that I'm going to be plugging in my camera to. And uh, just so you know, this comes with the template, which we don't need. We got a network camera, quick guide, WiseNet. Um, here, it usually has the default IP, so you can log into it. A couple instructions on there how to install it. Um, I'm not going to get into many details. I'm just going to go ahead and just show you guys pretty much, you know quick day installing the camera got a couple components here IO components IO standing for inputs outputs uh, audio microphone uh, all kinds of little things here uh, that I usually like to install with the camera uh, we got the camera here 360 degree view and uh, I'll show you guys right now I'll open it up and plug it in and uh, throw an IP in it Okay, now that I'm getting communication, I pinged. Uh, now I am logged in into the browser. It's gonna require you to uh, have a new password created. Hit uh, enter. Oh, just hit okay. See the lights right there. One for power, one for communication. It will ask you uh, if you want to apply the changes here. Uh, the username is uh, admin. And I'll go ahead and uh, uh, set up my password that I got for this. So. Camera. I'm sorry if you can't really see very well, but see the camera there. It's a 360, uh, 180 degree view camera. So, so it looks like. I think. Got this. Sorry about that, guys. So obviously, the more you pull this back, you know, it will go ahead and adjust the four lenses. But that's how it looks. Okay, it's a pretty cool camera. 180 degree view camera. Let's go ahead and install it. All right guys, I wanted to just real quick show you guys. Um, here you can tell that that's the uh, default IP 192.168.1.100 that, one, that, that I'm using to um, get to this camera. That's the default IP for the camera. You change uh, the IP on your computer to be able to reach it. Um, this is pretty much uh, where you usually go to change the IP. You go to basic settings, IP and port, enable, well, change uh, DHCP to manual. And then it lets you change the IP address here. While well, if it's uh, on DHCP, it doesn't let you. So this is uh, pretty much steps that you gotta do to change the IP so 
that's where you put your IP, your subnet mask, gateway, and uh, you just hit apply and it saves the settings. And then uh, that's pretty much how you change the IP on the camera. So for this camera, what we would have to do is uh, loosen up this screw and this screw right here to be able to get to the bottom of this camera. Okay, put this to the side. And here, pretty much tells you what you can actually use to what holes you can use to mount it or whatever and uh, this is pretty much gonna go up here which I already have holes made for so I just gotta pretty much just grab this and throw it up there and throw a couple screws and I'll show you guys how the view looks Okay guys, so this is how the camera looks. I still gotta put some new silicone around it. But um, maybe just adjust the view, either go up or down here. Cameras will go down and up. And uh, I'll show you guys a real quick view of how this looks. So this is the final image, what the customer wanted to see. And um, I'll show you guys how the camera looks uh, 100% complete. Okay. That's how it looks. Thanks for watching, guys.